personalities are out of the way. Time to drop some puck here for some Sunday afternoon hockey. Well, Bulldogs will win the first face off and snap that puck in. Commit Zaremba. Zaremba pass for Price, quick shot in front of the slot. It's a bouncing puck, nobody knew where it was. Eventually will be settled down as the Bulldogs are able to bump that puck into the neutral zone. It looks like there will be a penalty here. Two on one though, Jolly left side scores. Carter Cormier breaks the ice here in Black Falls. It's one nothing. By Wills, he's on the right wing, right wing side, excuse me. He's Nearly held down, no call on the play there. Saley able to hold the blue line, but eventually will be tapped out of midair by Brendan Ross, and now the Bulldogs come the other way. Brendan Ross on the forehand, scores! Brendan Ross with a good zone entry. Ross first on it. Cormier's gonna cough. Excuse me, get that puck right back for the Bulldogs, but Crusaders come back the other way. Nice pass here by Frost, able to find Wills. Wills sets it on net, he scores! Noah Wills popping the bottle, and the Crusaders cut the Bulldogs lead to just one goal. What a shot there from Noah Wills. As he's able to pick up his 28th of the season here, as you see Frost with a gorgeous pass and Noah Wills popping the bottle. Oh my. Feed back for Adrian. He's able to attempt to find Willick. Excuse me, do point on the far side boards. Kazicki once again quick to the offensive forward check. This forward check for this Crusaders is. Known to be troublesome for the breakout for most teams, as you see here. Now LaDuke on the opportunity, scores! Max LaDuke picking up his first as a Crusader, and he ties the game up at two apiece. Max LaDuke fired up on that one, as just as I was talking about how good this offensive forecheck was, and Right there, just to prove my point, Max LaDuke in a perfect spot there and just lets that one rip. Able to beat Maxfield, glove side, and we're tied up once again. He's surveying the ice, finds Wellen Rider. He loads up, finds a Saley who tees it up, he scores! Cole Asaley goes back to back games with a goal and it's three to two. And it looks like it was actually Hunter Price who tipped it on the play, so. Taking a look at it. Well, regardless, it was a power play goal for the Crusaders, regardless of who scored it, and we got the first lead of the game, but trying to take a look here, I, that's a tough one to call, I don't know, but point finds right side Ross. Still with it now is Patterson, top of the point. He sends it on from distance, and Ross scores. But hold on here. They're gonna take a quick look at this as Roos thought that one was high stick as the officials are gonna have a word. Adrian now down low for Dimitriadis. He nearly overskated it, but still able to correct himself and hold on to possession. Left side wing, now top of the point, McIntosh. He loads up, sent on net. Roos with a shoulder save, sends that back for Razor. He overskates it, McIntosh once again scores. Dakota McIntosh, he's picking up his 26th of the season. And the Bulldogs regain the lead. Power play, Raisler now, right side, finds Zaremba. Zaremba surveys the ice, pass over for Maxwell. Puck just hops over his stick, but able to regain possession cleanly. Christensen back for Raisler. He walks in, pass over for Howard, scores! 
What a feed from Adam Raisler, and the captain ties it up at fours apiece. What a feed there from Adam Raisler. As I think everybody in the building, including myself, looked like he wanted to rip that. As you see in there, he gets it just at the top of the circle with a lot of room to work with. Fakes the shot and just a perfect pass over for Hauer, who is pretty hyped about that one. I don't blame him. We're back tied up. Tied up. Now the Crusaders eventually able to get some offensive zone possession time here. Maxwell with a step. He sends it on net. Scores! Zach Maxwell goes bar down, and the Crusaders take that lead right back. I can still hear the post ringing in my ears. Oh, my, Zach Maxwell, what a rip. Good zone entry there by the Crusaders. As that seemed like an... Never stopping offensive zone possession for the Bulldogs. Howard, what a drop pass there. And Maxwell pops the bottle yet again. And that will be the hook for Maxfield. Absolute barn burner here in Black Falls, Alberta. As Maxwell, he's going to re receive the puck once again. Trying to center that pass for Bennett, who hopped up into the rush. Now it's Frost, one time shot, scores! Connor Frost from the top of the point, and now it's 6-4. Gabe Gratton on his first shot on net, lets that one glove side. And that's six goals on 14 shots for the Crusaders. Christensen, he's guarded closely by Brown. He's able to find Price for the one-time shot. Whistle it wide, but Wills once again on that loose puck rebound. Scoops it up for the Crusaders. Now pass over for Zaremba, scored! What a feed from Cade Christensen. And now it is a three-goal lead. Just pure octane offense coming from the first line for the Crusaders. Does that seem like that was at least a 45-second zone possession time as there was just a lot of cycling going on there as you see Wills he's able to cycle that one down low as Christensen just finds Zaremba and Zaremba being the everly skilled offensive player he is just able to find a nice area of space nobody even touched him Cade Christensen what a pass from him and seconds on the clock Kazeki he's gonna make a couple nice moves and gain the offensive line Lachlan Kazicki, he gets pinned along the boards. We're just three to play here, but looks like that will do it. That will take us to the end of the game. So Crusaders find themselves down to nothing in the first six minutes. We're able to rally back for the big 7-4 win over the ba Black Falls Bulldogs. <laughs>